Cancer, it's Elle here to do your August 2021 general monthly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, and commenting to the commenting on this video, uh, subscribing to the channel. It's all appreciated. Um, do know that all the links are below if you need to get in contact with me. All right, so Cancer, let's jump into this. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Cancer, let's see what the energy is for you this month. What it is the energy for Cancer this month? What is, okay, the four of wands. All right, so um, you could be focused on home life, um, your heart, your heart space, uh, redirect, redecorating your home space, um, beautifying your space, uh, parties at your home, uh, get-togethers. Also, it could be um, a successful completion of a project that maybe you were working on. It took some time. Um, so you'll celebrate that. Um, also, um, reunion, reconciliation is showing up here too. Um, you'll celebrate just that. Uh, good times, fun times, um, just feeling more stable in you, uh, in your home, um, in what you do in terms of um, what you do may be associated with, um, you just are good at, uh, right now you feel good with your foundation. You feel good with what you have made for yourself. You feel good with what, you're com what you have completed. Um, this could be on the job front. This could be in love. There could be a new relationship here. Um, if it's not a new relationship, then it's just you getting together with friends, people you like, people you enjoy, um, just having a good time. Um, also, it could be, yeah, getting together. It could be uh, feminine energies coming up. You could be hanging around a lot of women, or um, if you're not hanging around a lot of women, um, you could be in groups of women. I don't know if you have a circle, you know, like a social event where you will, there are a lot of women there or something of that nature. You could even work around a lot of women here. But um, the, the energy of this month is celebration, completion, uh, strong foundation, um, redoing, re renewing also, and reunion, okay? So something that you need to release this month. Ooh, that came right out. Seven of Cups. So you might need to release this procrastination spirit maybe that you have. Um, this lack of seriousness and or commitment. This overindulgence, over drinking, over eating, over spending. Just no balance. Not having balance in your relationships, in your business, in your um, marriage, if you are married, um, you need to release frivolousness. Um, also you need to release, and, and, and it could be you or it could be a person that is like this or a situation that brings on this type of energy. You need to release, um, the seven of cups here, all of these choices and these options, you need to make a decision because they are fleeting. Um, you're running out of time on something. Uh, here, you need to release uh, with the Seven of Cups. Maybe somebody makes false promises. They have no intentions of fulfilling anything that they say. You need to release um, a cheating, philandering spouse. Um, you just need to release something that is not good for you. Seven of Cups talks about seven deadly sins, okay? Um, gluttony. I'm hearing gluttony. Maybe overeating. All right. So, um, what something that you need to reevaluate re here? Let's see what you need to reevaluate in the month of August. What do you need to reevaluate? Does Cancer need to reevaluate in the month of August? Okay, the lovers. It could be a Gemini. It could be your choice or a choice of lovers. Um, a significant relationship. Also. Someone that you um, hold dear, fond to your heart. Someone who you feel like there is the perfect union with them. Um, you need to reevaluate this. 
need to reevaluate this choice also. Uh, right now, it's coming up in the healthier sense. The opposite of this card would be the devil card. Um, right now, you need to reevaluate what is healthy, what relationship is healthy, because the six talks about health, wellness, your analytical nature, and this is something that you need to reevaluate. Did you make the right choice in love or in love and work or what you're working toward or what you're giving your energy, your force to? Did you make the right choice here? Um, is there another choice? Is it still available to you? Are they still available to you if this is a person? This is something you need to reevaluate. <laughs> something you need to think about here. Um, with the six, you need to think about where you find harmony, balance, okay, Com not completion, but harmony, balance, um, where you find a sense of service, you know, where you find like, this works well for me, I feel good here, um, my soul, it resonates with my soul, or this person resonates with my soul, so you need to reevaluate re some connection here okay and it could be in terms of work or love or work or choosing what you love to do over work or something of that nature okay um something that you've neglected this month what has the cancer what will the cancer neglect in the month of august 2020 ooh, it flipped out the ten of cups so maybe you've neglected your family Maybe you've neglected what really makes you happy. Um, maybe you have neglected, yeah, you've neglected your family, um, what really makes you happy. You've neglected some masculine energy here also. Um, it could be a father figure. It could be a powerful man here. You have neglected them or they have neglected you. Um, or this person has neglected their family for you. Um, what you, something you've neglected you've neglected um, maybe calling a truce okay um within your family or with a specific person maybe a masculine energy you've neglected um this you have neglected coming back together you have neglected um actually uh, performing well in a connection so that you can actually have happiness you can have the highest level of happiness says the ten of cups you didn't show up you know in the capacity that you needed to show up or maybe your person didn't but something has been neglected here in terms of the ten of cups um it could be your own family um it could be the fact that um you are a family man you need to spend a little bit more time something here it's like a you've neglected the fact that you need to you, you've neglected the fact of how your family looks at you, your identity in terms of how your family sees you. Um, maybe you just neglected your family altogether. It just, it just doesn't matter to you. You're doing you. You're putting yourself first. Um, so that's what we have there. Um, something you, you can look forward to. Seven of Wands, you can look forward to psychic abilities being heightened toward the opposite sex. You can look forward to peace, prosperity, and success. Um, if you just stay on your sphere, if you stay on your square, if you don't let anything destruct you or destruct what you're trying to construct for yourself. Um, the Seven of Wands talks about someone trying to get your attention. Or trying to maintain your attention or trying to get you to look over here or look over there um, just really trying to destruct okay because maybe they devalue what you're doing or they want to devalue you um someone wants to come in and uh, stir you stir the pot also is what i'm hearing um fight for what you have um what you have made or what you have maintained also Fight for what you have. Fight for what you have maintained. And if it's your peace, fight for your peace. If you don't want anyone disturbing it, make sure you are away from those people and they don't have access to you. Um, something that will help you this month. Let's see what will help you this month. Nice. 
Beast, the Hierophant. So this could be a particular person. It could be a Taurus coming up there. Um, or this could just be rule, regimen, routine. So that's what's going to help you. If you have some rules that you follow, the, the beauty of it is you get to make them. If you have a routine that you follow, you get to make that also. Some regimen about yourself. Maybe some traditional value or value or morals. This is what um, will help you uh, this month. Also, maybe some clergymen or maybe if you talk to a pastor or, um, or you talk to someone who can give you guidance, this will help you. Or you just find guidance um, in a routine, okay? You find guidance in being structured, okay? So that's what's going to help you this month. It looks like an overall really good month for you. You have some connections you need to reevaluate. Um, the energy this month is really good for wands, having a really good time, and enjoying yourself, your home, um, what you've created for yourself. Um, you might have neglected your family or, or things or a person that makes you really happy. Put some time, some energy into that. Don't let anyone destruct what you're trying to construct. And make sure you have rural regimen about your life in the month of August. It looks like everything will turn out well. Cancer, if you feel like this reading resonates for you, go ahead and click the like button. Uh, go over to the website book there. You can also ask a question by texting it to the number below. Get in on the New Moon Lionsgate uh, manifestation ritual happening on August 8th. Uh, if you want to bring new energy into your life take advantage okay the link is below also you can donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you cancer many blessings to you take care